Hey guys, so as you know, I'm working with Maybelline and this month's trend is a winter beauty trend called Rebel Reds where we focus on gold and smoky hues and we accent with mesmerizing reds, which is perfect for the holiday season. So if you're interested in recreating this look, then stay tuned. Okay, so first I'm going to start off with an eyeshadow primer and this is basically just to help the eyeshadow stick and adhere to your eyes without sweating off. Um, this increases the longevity of the eyeshadow and also helps it pop a little bit more. And then going in with the skin tone color powder, this will act as my transition color. It will help diffuse any harsh lines that may appear whenever I apply the darker colors. So I'm just using a fluffy 217 uh, blending brush right here. Then going into the Maybelline The Nudes eyeshadow palette, I'm taking this soft matte brown and a tapered blending brush and I'm just going to apply this brown to the outer area of the eye, the outer V, and also blend it into the crease area and this will just give it a more smoky effect. And then going back in with that fluffy blending brush, I'm just going to use this brush to blend out any harsh lines that I see because it has product left on it. And then going back into the nudes palette, taking some of that matte black, I'm just going to apply it right on top of the brown in the outer V area of the eye and this would just help intense the smokiness and also adds depth and dimension. Taking some of the bronzy brown color, I'm just going to use my flat shader brush and I'm just going to apply this all over the eyelid, making sure it's stop right at the end of the smokiness. And then also bring it into the inner tear duct area of the eye. And just kind of blend the two colors together, the smoky color and then the bronzy color. And then I'm also going to add it to the lower lash line right in the center. Going in with my Master Kajel Eye Cold Pencil in Midnight Brown, I'm just using this to smoke out the lower lash line by applying it to the outer two-third areas of the eye. And then I'm going to smudge it out using my flat shader brush. And then going back into the palette and taking some of this really pretty yellowish gold, I'm going to apply this to the inner tear duct area of the eye. So like the inner one third area of the eye, making sure to blend it up into the bronzy brown color. And then also making sure to apply it to the lower lash line because this will make the eyes look awake. And then just follow up by adding a cold liner to the waterline to kind of tighten up the eye look. And then next I'm going to go in with my liquid liner and this is by Ico and I'm just going to draw a winged liner. I'm not going to exaggerate it this time but just enough to make the eyes pop. And then next is time for mascara. I'm using the Big Eyes Rubble Black Mascara by Maybelline. And there's two parts to this mascara. There's one for the upper lashes, which has a thicker, bigger wand. And this just helps volumize and extend the lashes. And then there's one for the lower lashes, which has a smaller wand. And this just helps super separate the lashes and then uh, extend them as well. And then for the lips, I'm going to line my lips with Night Moth by MAC. And it's a perfect pair for Maybelline's Color Sensation Matte Lipstick in Divine Wine. These two together make the perfect cranberry lip combo. And it goes well with any smoky eye combination. So this is like perfect for the holiday season. And then to top off the look, I'm going to use my favorite highlighter. This is by Bobbi Brown. And I'm just going to use my fan brush to kind of blend it onto the highest points of the cheekbone area, making sure to blend it downward. This just completes the look. For the nails, I've used Paint the Town number 260 by Maybelline. And this is from the Color Show Collection. It looks amazing. And it goes really well with the red lips. This is a perfect look for the holiday season. I hope you guys enjoy. Feel free to give this video a thumbs up if you like. And I just can't wait till next time. Bye.